government. How much do we really know about what they do? We have to find out. And we have to find out why our voice has been squandered. You all want to be heard. Here's your forum. But I'm not the person. He's not the person. He's not the person to get mad at. We're all here for the same reason. We want to be heard. I, I'm curious, who, how did this start? Who, who called for it? You know, is someone, something. Call for this yeah, who today. The who created the Facebook group? Who created this particular event and picked this time and place? I, I don't know. It was our choice. Oh. <laughs> the collective process. Yeah, it doesn't matter, yeah? Yeah, I don't know. So, location, time, day, uh, uh, Facebook, logistics, decision-making process. Okay. Anything else? Does it go and stay as long as you can stay? Or is it like a shift schedule so people can budget their time that, contributions? That's something to be discussed amongst us. Because I once waited in a line in a public place for six weeks and the way we did it and made it sustainable was you took shifts. Okay. Well, that's, that's another thing. It also helps thi get around the sleeping in public issue because if you're taking a shift, you right. don't sleep. Right. Well, that's, that's, an, uh, that's a good idea. And that's at this point, that's what we're looking for. We're looking for ideas on how to make this successful. So does anybody have proposals on the decision-making process? Oh my god, um, thank you so much. All right, so something that we can, we can try to do uh, is I've been, I've been experimenting with a couple of different intentional communities and there's a thing called the uh, consensus process. Uh, it's very, people use different hand signals, but hand signals are a pretty common theme. And uh, so when you have somebody, when you have somebody proposing something, um, there are some hand signals to kind of take a take a feel of how the audience feels about what's being proposed. Um, and all during during each agenda point, we're making a stack for that particular agenda point. Um, so quickly go over some hand signals. When I do it, and this is what we do when we agree with somebody what they're saying. This is what we do when we don't agree. Why not an up or down vote? Uh, well, there, everything, everything comes to a vote eventually, but this is sort of a way to make sure if people don't have a lot to say, they don't want to go, go on stack and say, oh, I agree. It's just to be like, to take a feel of how everyone feels, but there's still votes. There's still votes on something. It's a small enough group. Uh, the term consensus is uh, kind of ambiguous, but sometimes in a smaller group, one person can block consensus and the decision doesn't happen. Uh, in larger groups, you usually do by percent. The consensus could be 90%, could be 75%. Uh, I was just down at Occupy Boston earlier, and someone was telling me right now they have consensus at 75% of the vote. Um, and so basically, and that's, that's the gist of it. Uh, point, here's, here's where the other guys are more important. There's, this is point of process. When we're on a particular agenda item, and if someone seems to be straying from the point of the agenda item, if someone seems to be straying from the point of the agenda item, you raise this signal, and uh, you speak up and you say, I think we're straying from the point. Um, there's various there's other uh, signals that we can explore. Occupy Boston streams their general assemblies every day uh, live, so we can look at those if you want. They're in the morning and the afternoon. Um, but also, something that people have been doing is when we're in a large circle like this, whoever's speaking will say something and the rest of the group will repeat it right after. It makes it so people don't have to yell, it makes it so we don't need megaphones or microphones, so let's try that. We are the General Assembly in Manchester. We are the General Assembly in Manchester. We're currently discussing decision-making process. We're currently discussing decision-making process. Does anybody want to be on stack for this agenda item? Does anybody want to be on stack for this agenda item? That was a real question. Because uh, <laughs> I, mean, I pretty much said everything I have to say about it. I think we should get other people involved. You know, I, I would just suggest that we, we go to something more traditional, like, uh, you know, we, we elect ourselves a, a chairman. We use Robert's Rules, where we, we propose. We, no. no. Why, why, why the... Why is that? How is, that be, how, how, because, how is this? Because, because we, we, we choose the leader. We can re-elect the leader at any point. We also need a secretary. This is the secretary. Basically, we only need someone to take a stack, and everyone else self-moderates. So that's the point of saying point of process. In favor of consensus with a two-thirds majority vote for resolutions. 
Is everybody okay? all in favor? What are the options? Yeah. Uh, there's in favor, opposed, and abstain. People don't have to vote if they don't want to vote. So, what are you in favor of? What's that? Can we speak? Is that a motion? Oh, yeah, absolutely. No, so, motion, but if, 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 so when I say motion to vote, if someone wants to continue the discussion, block motion to vote and say let's continue the discussion, we'll continue the discussion. Block motion to vote. So okay. Uh, all right. Well, then, if anyone wants to discuss the topic, get on the stack. It sort of depends on what our agenda is, but we haven't decided that yet. But the only way that I would actually recommend Concord is if we were really focusing on state issues and things that the state house was going to be able to comply with that we would be there to put pressure on the state house. I don't get the impression that that's going to be the case and so I don't see any other compelling reasons to go with Concord. I think there's lots of great reasons to go with Manchester. To, uh, to wrap it up there, um, even if uh, if there's nowhere and everywhere we try to ask, if the cops say no, you can't go here, we cannot let that stop us. We have to pick a point and say we are going right. to go here yeah. and yeah. we are going to protest even if you say no. Exactly. Oh. Oh. Uh, I'm going to support Manchester and Veterans Park. We're organizing an occupation. We're not organizing a protest. We don't have to ask for permission. Wall Street did not have permission. Dewey Square did not have permission. Hey, Egypt right. did not have permission. Tunisia did not have permission. And when they occupied the capital uh, in Wisconsin, they did not have permission either. I would say uh, the most important thing is figure out what you're ready to commit to and then meet that commitment because basically the, the test for success or failure is when you fail to meet what you promised the public you would do. So if that means doing it 12 hours a day instead of 24, decide now, because you don't want to fail it. In Boston, in Boston, we had three planning meetings. We had three planning meetings. But we didn't call for Occupy Boston. But we didn't call for Occupy Boston. Till three or four days before Occupy Boston. Till three or four days before Occupy Boston. Boston is different than New Hampshire. Boston is different than New Hampshire. But I believe everyone here. But I believe everyone here can definitely bring enough people. Can definitely bring enough people that numbers won't be an issue. That numbers won't be an issue. The main thing. The main thing will be logistics, will be logistics. Uh, media, Wi-Fi, all that stuff, which you don't have to repeat. <laughs> he found her guilty of. I think we'd help you guys with down here at all. Or? Is anybody in charge? Or? No, no one's in charge. No one's in charge. General okay. Assembly. I just sat down here just to check on you guys, see if you need any help with anything. Or? Uh, oh, thank you. So, what, is, what is this all about? Uh, occupying New Hampshire's first General Assembly. Okay. Yeah, please. Thank you. All right. So discuss, just discussing our ideas and how we feel. That's fine. All right. We'll send down and see if you guys need anything at all. Oh, thank you. That's a lovely thing to hear. Oh, where most of you folks out of? Here. Yeah, I'm from Something Nashua, in. Manchester. I've heard people from Wolfsburg, all over the state. Right. So. Be careful. The river's running pretty, uh, pretty strong this time. Nobody <laughs> fall in. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Who's uh? What's with the, is this powering something? Or? I think um, the, uh, somebody is doing a live feed. Okay. Okay. No, that's fine. Just so that uh, somebody drives over. Picks up the wire. All right. You know, like you said, just be careful. Don't fall in. All right. All right. Thank Have a good night. Thank you. Good night. G16956. Oh, no, okay. Mic check. Mic check. I want to thank my brothers and sisters. I want to thank my brothers and sisters for coming out on a cold night. For coming out on a cold night and helping to play their part and helping to play their part in what will surely be and what will surely be a very historic a very historic and important movement an important movement for empowering the working class for empowering the working class in this very trying time in this, in this very trying time we should all realize we should all realize how special this this movement is how special this movement is 
and get a sense of our collective power. And get a sense of our collective power. Together we can do anything. Together we can do anything. Thank you all very much. Thank you all very much. Woo! I propose the steps. For a group photo right now if you want. For a group photo right now if you want. Woo! 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 Do not fall in the water. Demand some kind of